Hi, I'm Shatakshi. Welcome to my channel and uh, I'm here to share a very interesting tale with all of you. So in my first year of St. Stephen's College, I'm a graduate of St. Stephen's College and I met this really interesting guy. He, were, he was not really known for taking detailed notes after or during the classes. Um, whenever I observed him, I would just see that he was scribbling something on the corners of the professor's handout. In the college residence, uh, residence is basically the college hostel, he was known as the college topper or the campus uh, uh, branch topper as well. Uh, I used to really marvel, I used to, I was really impressed by him back then and of course uh, even during our final year I noticed that he was this guy who was cracking all the postgraduate examinations including GMAT, GRE etc. But what really happened towards the end of the college when he actually attempted a lot of interviews was he did not really quite succeed at getting the top dream job that he was aiming to. And with the benefit of the hindsight, um, I have also realized that even till date, he has not realized the best or not achieved the best of the best dreams that he always wanted to and unfortunately so. Back then, like I said, I was really admiring his talent, his geniuses, all his naturally gifted wits. But what I realized is those talents have very limited application in the real world in the job market. Um, of course, what I realized in the real world with the benefit of the experiences I have is more than those talents, what really is important is communication skills, your ability to embrace uncertainty, being agile, having the empathy, those are all the characteristics that really define whether you are going to be successful or whether you are going to be able to crack the job interviews. If I were to be extremely honest, even when I started my career, um, I used to focus more on the problem solving aspect, which in my world is little more technical than the softer aspects. But only when I figured out the secret ingredient, I was definitely able to crack more job interviews and at the same time crack my MBA interviews as well. What I've come to realize is that I am not a genius and we all marvel geniuses. We are obsessed with people who are geniuses, who are smarts, with high IQ, etc. And we probably many a times actually comment that I am not able to uh, achieve XYZ things, probably because I'm not a genius myself. Um, with respect to all the small humble milestones that I've achieved in my life, they have more to do with the learning mindset and they have more to do with the active practicing mindset that I have achieved than being just a genius. So here is what I would actually advise you to do or give you as an insight. Uh, back then, almost 10 years ago, uh, I took a chance upon myself. I would advise you that you also take one more chance upon yourself to thrive and survive in your career. Thank you so much.